Okay, guys. Today we're going to go over a few words because I get in a lot of arguments on Facebook with stupid people and they seem to have a lot of trouble with these words. So I'm going to explain them to you. I'm going to give you the word. I'm going to give you the definition. And then I'm going to explain the definition of that word, okay? Now we're going to make this quick and simple. All right, the first one, y'all get confused a lot. That's fact and opinion. All right? Fact. Definition. A thing that is indisputably the case. That means no matter what, it is proven. It is backed. It is fact. I get arguments on Facebook all the time where I'll tell people a fact and they'll be like, well, that's your fact. It's not the same for everyone. Yes, it is. Fact is the same for everyone. It's a fact. No matter what, it's a fact. It wasn't the same for everyone. It's an opinion. Now, opinion. A view or judgment formed about something not necessarily based on fact or knowledge. Okay? That means chances are an opinion is based off of your feelings. It's how you feel about it. It's what you think about it. And it's fine. You're allowed to have your opinion. I just want you all to know, I don't give a fuck about your opinion. The world does not care about your opinion. The world is going to hurt your feelings. You need to get over it. It's not that hard. Nobody cares about your opinion. You can speak it. It's fun being an American. Everyone can speak it. They say whatever they want, whatever they want. Doesn't change the fact that I don't have to care about your opinion, and I never will. Okay? Now, this next one I got in an argument on Facebook about. And I thought this argument was stupid. Because I told the dude everything he's telling me is a lie. It's not true, so it's not information. He said, well, it's still information. doesn't matter if it comes from a credible source. That's not true. Okay? Information. Facts. Provided on or learned about something or someone. Okay? Facts. Now, you guys know what a fact is. That means it's true. If it's information and it's not true, then it's not information. It's bullshit. It's not information. Information is true. Okay? It's fact. It's not that hard. Now we're going to get into the really special one. The one I know is going to hurt a lot of your guys' feelings. And I'm okay with this. Because I really, really want you guys to understand. And I kind of really want to hurt your feelings. Because it's kind of fun for me. Gender. Alright? It's not that hard. The state of being male or female. Male or female. It says that in the definition. Male or female. Okay? That means there is no bon non-binary. There is no gender neutral or gender fluid. You're either male or you're female. That you're on the options. Now, how you express that gender is entirely up to you. Okay? If you're a dude and you like dresses, that's fine. It doesn't make you non binary. It just means you're a feminine dude. You're still a dude. Still a dude. I'm a dude. I like chick flicks and rom coms, musicals, bright collars. All that's fine. I'm still a dude. If you're a girl and you like football and video games and stuff that's typically for guys, you're still a girl. Right? You're still a chick. That doesn't change. You can like guy shit and still be a girl. Matter of fact, most guys will like you better for that. And my, my, my girlfriend loves video games. We can hang out. We can shit talk. Everything. Me and my love can chill and play video games whenever I want. But that leaves me a choice. See, I can go and bro down and chill with my dude friends. So I can hang out with this beautiful woman with soft skin. It smells like roses or pumpkin spice or some sweet smell that always makes you smile. Or I can do, do the same things that I do with her with one of my guy friends who I just spent eight hours working with. is as ugly as me and smells like fat guy sweat. 
it's not a tough choice. So you can be whichever one you want. Uh, you can express it however you want. You can't be whichever one you want. You can express it however you want. But despite what you want to believe, you're still male. You're still female. That doesn't change. You can't tell me what male and female is. The definition does not say the state of feeling like a male or female. No, no. The state of being male or female. That's it. No gender neutral, no non-binary, no fucking putting X on your birth certificate, which is one of the stupidest fucking things I've ever heard of, but we'll get into that in a different video. I'm going to make a whole goddamn video about that one. That's fucking retarded. I don't care about your pronouns. I don't care what you want to be called. I don't care what hurts your feelings. Either way, you're still a male. You're still a female. Fucking deal with it. That's all for today. Have a good day. And I honestly hope I hurt your feelings. Enjoy.